and our education system must provide opportunities for all our students. In every neighborhood, students must be able to enter schools which can enable them to have social mobility, to rise above themselves, their circumstances, to uplift the young and their families. Regardless of background, whether they're rich or poor, we must ensure that they are able to be developed to their full potential. And indeed, across the island, our schools must continue this Singapore story for each new generation. Our generation experienced a massive social mobility. All of us have our own stories to tell. But each generation must have their own Singapore story. One such example for this new generation is Lim Ong Ning. Ong Ning lost her father. She's a student of this school. She lost her father when she was in secondary two. And of course, after that, her family faced financial difficulties. But at Dunman, Ong Ning was an excellent student, both in her studies, as well as a student leader in the Dunman Choir. And in spite of her family difficulties, she was not denied the opportunity to learn and grow because she received the MOE's financial assistance scheme. And when the Dunman Choir was invited to participate in a prestigious overseas competition, the school helped her to secure the necessary financial aid so that she could go there and compete with the rest of the choir. Ong Ning has done very well last year in the GCEO level examination. In fact, she scored eight distinctions. She's now a student at RJC. So through her belief, the opportunities this school and this community gave her, the encouragement of the teachers, the choir master, she's another example of a Singapore story for this generation, overcoming the odds, becoming a standing leader and an excellent student. And that's what our education system must do. It must provide pathways to students of different abilities, not only those who are academically bright, but with diverse talents. We all accept that not all of us can be academically bright. Not all of us are. And I'm glad that Dunman is following this philosophy because it helps students across whether they express normal academic or normal technical courses. So the life science course that we visited, all students, regardless of where which express normal academic, normal tech, will go through them. They have a differentiated curriculum which are tailored to the students' needs, but they help them to learn things in their own way. One such student who benefited from the life science program is Justin Lee. He likes to watch science documentaries. He wants to be an inventor. So he joined the life science programs in secondary one. So he's happily picking up these skills in molecular biology. I saw them by petting and running gel sequences, cutting up their own enzymes and trying to find out how the DNA works. And I think it's a great experience for all students. We wish students like Justin Lee every success.